Hello everyone, this is Maya Fano Simani Sinclair. He will be the one featured throughout this video. Afano Simanis are native to Costa Rica, but can also be found in Nicaragua and Guatemala. The care for Simanis is relatively simple. I currently house Sinclair in a great choice large critter tote. He is currently on 4 inches of substrate because he is new to my collection and in quarantine. Normally I would recommend 6 inches of substrate if yours likes to burrow. For decoration, he currently has a couple of Imaginarium's creature comfort sticks, a basic pumpkin hide, and some fake plants. As far as water goes, I provide Sinclair with one water dish and some waste substrate close to the bottom so when he would like some more moisture, he can burrow down to get it. When it's time to eat, I gut load my feeders beforehand with carrots, collard greens, mustard greens, and turnip greens. I usually feed him one to two superworms per week unless he's looking a bit thin. The temperature around my house is mid-70s to low 80s. I wouldn't worry about temperature too much unless it drops below 60 or above 90 degrees. Check out some other YouTubers who may own AC Money so you can figure out what you would like to do with yours. Be sure to check out Tom's Big Spiders. He was a huge inspiration for me to get this species. The Afano Pamasimani is a little more uncommon in the hobby. If you can find a captive bred sling, I would snatch it up because I think experts and beginners alike will enjoy the species in their collection. It is important to find captive bred specimens. As I said before, the species is a little more uncommon in the hobby. Wild caught specimens can bring in dangerous worms such as nematodes or be infested with mites, fungal infections, have abscesses, and mold defects. Not to mention buying wild-caught specimens would encourage people to take these beautiful creatures out of their natural habitats. I hope you enjoyed this video and may consider adding an AC money to your collection.